Yoga is just these two components. It's only these two components. Powerful cognitions. Through that, making that ecstasy shower in you. Whenever you feel, understand, whenever you feel some great understanding inside about you, society, humanity, life, nature, cosmos, and feel relieved, ecstatic, the rain starts. The alchemy starts. If that rain happens, you will have brain. Otherwise, everything is drain. <laughs> Understand, if you can constantly make that rain happen in you, some of the major internal or external crisis you are able to just crack it by this cognitions, powerful cognitions. And it just becomes such powerful eye-opener. Your whole chemistry becomes different. The chemistry in your brain becomes different. How many of you have experienced this in your life? So you all know. Understand. Yoga is only this two. One, that. Making this intense alchemy to happen in you. Second, building a body through which you can continue to enjoy that alchemy experience, that spiritual strength, that ecstasy. You need to know yoga is not limited to just stretching the body. It is unfortunate yoga is getting re like a branded as replacement for a gym. No. In yoga, what you eat matters. How you eat matters. Who touched it matters. It's not just stretching the body. It is stretching the body also. 